but it's better than crying. It has been a minute. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Isabella. If it's your first time here, welcome. Hello. Thanks for hanging out with me today. It's definitely been a friggin' minute since. I've sat down and filmed a video, but finally it's up, it's out here, it's coming. My camera died, so I'm not going to say the whole spiel again, but it's definitely been a minute, like I said. Uh, I'm not going to ramble too much, so let's just get into this video, you know the drill. After you subscribe, hit that subscribe button, you know, maybe give me a thumbs up if you're feeling it. If not, let's just, let's just get into the makeup. So, honestly, I really am not sure exactly what, ouch, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going for here, you know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. My hair looks good. I just gotta keep it back for now. Um, I think it's been a minute since I've used, I know that this is awkward timing, but my Kylie X Jordan palette. Um, so I'm just gonna kind of, I'm just gonna kind of play around, you know, see what I'm feeling. I hate to be that girl that's like, alright, like, August is over, so it's fall. But you know, sometimes you just gotta be that girl because I'm not gonna do summer looks. You know, should I keep doing summer looks? So I think I'm gonna start out with my Tardius Pro palette. And I'm gonna go in with the shade Innocent. And I'm just gonna put that right in the crease. I don't really wanna do anything like super glittery or anything like that. I kinda just wanna, kinda just wanna make it a little bit more on the matte side. So now I'm going to go in with the shade Whimsy. After that. And just darken up the crease a little bit. I feel like I haven't filmed and uploaded since I've moved though. Um. I've been trying to like get everything together. I did film one video. I didn't like it. You guys already know the drill with that, how that goes. I never like any videos, so I always have to refilm them and redo them. But I think today I was like, I'm just gonna film. I'm just gonna sit and see where it takes me. Now I'm gonna go in with the Kylie palette and I'm gonna take the shade Sister, which is this brown shade, and I'm just gonna tap that okay I'm not doing any tapping I'm just kind of working that on the outer corner and then I'm going to actually put that on the inner corner as well this is not not the brush for that but doesn't look bad. I'm just gonna blend that out so nothing is like too harsh. Everything is just blended. And I don't think I'm gonna do like a cut crease or anything like that. You know, I lied. I lied. I'm going to, because this shade is so pretty, I'm gonna take this, the shade Loyal, which is like this green shade. And I'm going to put that right in the center. And it doesn't show up super green. It's kind of like more of like a goldy undertone. And I'm just applying that with my finger right in the middle. So it's kind of like that halo effect. And I'm going to bring it up a little bit too like kind of in the crease area 
so it's just like you know so now I'm gonna go in with a different brush and I'm gonna go back in with that brown shade tap off all the excess and I'm just going to make sure that the brown blends into the greenish gold shade so it doesn't just look like a strip and everything just looks like blended nice You know what I think we're gonna do? I think we're gonna do a wing. So, I can attempt to do this, showing you guys, but I feel like that's just not gonna work because I'm kind of always just like really in the zone. I feel like I look like actually insane right now, but that's all right, you know, it's okay. I think it's gonna come together nicely. I'm just gonna do, yeah, I don't know why I'm doing it like this. I'm just gonna do a little, that's actually a lot, of my MAC strobe cream and just work that into the skin for a nice, glowy look. I'm gonna actually go in with my Too Faced Born This Way foundation. And honestly, I don't think I'm tan enough for it. But I wanna pretend that I'm tan. So. Concealer. We're just gonna brighten this face up. We're just gonna go in with the concealer too because you know who doesn't need a little extra coverage under their eyes? An extra. Oh my god, I'm just kind of slapping that on. And I already did underneath my eyes, which honestly, I see people do that all the time in videos. Like, they'll do their eye makeup, and then before they do their face, they'll do, like, their lower lash line. And I have no idea how they do that, and then they get their concealer, like, so precise. And everything just looks, like, so perfect. I'm not a huge fan of that coverage. Um, I do like... The finish on it it's like a really light finish and it kind of has like a little bit of dew to it but i'm just gonna add this a little bit for some better coverage i want to do a fun fun video pretty soon it's a hair tutorial and i'm thinking that if i just say it out loud and like I let you guys know that then my cousin will have to come do it with me. She's like a little bit on the shy side. So we're just going to have to get her out of that. Because there's no being shy over here, okay? we got to snap her right out of that. I just think that everyone can benefit from okay, I'm making this. her techniques in this hairstyle. It's just so cute. Personally, I cannot do it on myself. That's why she's gonna come and teach us how to do it. I think that that would be a cute idea. We'll see. We're gonna see. I'm just setting my makeup now with my air spun. I dropped nail my nail glue my eyelash glue and we're just gonna go in and bronze up the face now because we just need to I'm using this little sample it's by Hanalei Hanalei it's a matte bronzer I 
And I actually really like it. So I'm probably going to go buy this because... You guys know that I always have like such a hard time finding a good bronzer that I really love. That's not like super chalky or too warm tone or too cool tone. I feel like this one is not too cool tone or warm tone. I feel like it's just perfect. Like my Physician's Formula, I love that, but it is a little bit too warm for me sometimes. That's why like I usually just kind of do it during the day. Now we're going to do some blush and this is by, I believe this is by... I don't know how to pronounce that, so. I don't know how to pronounce the brand. I think it's like Finding Ferdinand. I'm honestly terrible with names, but it's actually a really, really pretty blush. It's in the shade Skinny Dip. Like I said, this is all over the place. I don't mean to sound like so freaking basic, but, but. I am just so excited for fall. Like this is the best time of the year. Like once it starts kind of cooling down, it's not like overbearingly hot anymore. And you can wear long sleeves or you can wear like jeans and a t-shirt. I just feel like that is just perfect weather. And I'm here for it. This is by Pure Cosmetics and this is the shade Afterglow. And I feel like this just kind of goes with the eyeshadow. Like it's a nice gold shade. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, we are finished. This is my hair, like, completely natural. If you could see, I'm going to zoom this out a little. Put my mirror down. It's just, like, completely natural. It has, like, a cute little weight. Like, this is just, like, a nice little ringlet. And then this is just wavy. That's just how it goes. I just wish that the green eyeshadow was like a little bit more green. I think that would look cute, but that is all. We are finished. We're done. Thanks for hanging out with me today, guys, because I really missed you. It's been a minute since I've done a video, but I'm definitely going to upload this. I hope to get it up really, really, really soon. I'm slacking a little bit. I need to get back on the grind, back on my game, get shit going. But as always, thanks for hanging out with me today. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Please don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.